What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Kaguya Sama Love is War season two, episodes seven and eight. Uh, last episode, my boy Miyuki got re elected. Miko Ino, everyone is coming back. Everyone is nice and happy. We have a new edition of Miko Ino who finally has some who finally had some happiness happen in her school career, her school life. So I'm very excited to see where this goes. I do know the finale of season three, the most recent one, is coming out like next week, something along those lines. I am very excited. I need to catch up ASAP so I can watch that with you guys. You know, the show has been nothing but hilarious, amazing moments, super extra, super OD, but just amazing so far. With that being said, if you guys want early access and full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, all that is available for episodes up to one week on that Patreon. Links are down below. Like always, make sure you guys go check that out. Don't forget to subscribe and to click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Much appreciated, y'all. Let's hop right on into this. Kaguya-sama, Love is War, Season 2, Episodes 7 and 8. Let's do this. Underwear. This is not how I would expect us to start, but okay. Of anyone to be caught changing, it was not supposed to be Ishigami. <laughs> yeah, once you let Chika in on some knowledge like that, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. See, I'm more of a just a boxers myself. I'm not I'm not a huge I'm not a huge briefs kind of guy. A man whore. Alright, is Siri, what's the definition of a man whore? A man who Okay, so now with the context of what briefs and boxers mean for their respective man. Now Kaguya wants to know what kind of underwear Miyuki wears. I was expecting Miyuki and Ishigami to be wondering what kind of panties they wear, but I was completely incorrect. We're not talking about the color style. <laughs> right. <laughs> he finally processed what she said. Imagine someone asking you what kind of underwear you wear or you like, and you just say black panties. Boxers briefs, boxer briefs. He's a man whore. Even though I had faith in him, he's a man whore. Imagine you're coming to the, the student council room. No, you know, it, it's not what it looks like. I swear to God. No. I sw He quit wearing briefs that very same day. <laughs> he got roasted. He's like, I'm done. That was the weirdest part of an episode. That was so funny. I mean, hand massages are lovely, you know? Vasopressin? Really? That's very true. Is that is that true? That has to be true. Because when you're done, like you have no mood. Like so, I'm like, she's always plotting something. It's Kaguya. <laughs> she is always doing that. This music that they play, you know, when it goes like, oh, it's so funny. It is so funny and so extra. Oh, 
They both have the exact opposite emotions, like he is going through the more pain ever. <laughs> he can't even finish his sentence. That is so funny. She thinks that was a crazy misunderstanding. I was super awkward, and then she's gonna walk in and Kaguya goes. I'm a novice. This music that they always do is so funny, I tell you. <laughs> His shoulders are much looser now. Oh, okay. It hurt like a bitch, but it worked. This is K. Oh, what manga? I'll go with sweet today. What do you mean, just manga, Miyuki? Oh, this is gonna be an episode of Miyuki reading manga. He's in the bathtub crying. <laughs> he collected all. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> Ishigami is going to be crying as well. This has got to be like... <laughs> this was me watching like Toradora, Bunny Girl Senpai, you know? Bake Monogatari. <laughs> I just want to be in love. <laughs> That's so funny. Maybe in school, not for me. Now, in my community, nothing's too embarrassing. We read whatever, right, guys? Okay. I'm saying I would never hang out with Chica talking about something like that. Okay. I don't know why, but I don't think it's based on that. Isn't wasn't there a book where it's like two kids went to the same school and one of them had like a terminal illness and was about to die? The Fault in Our Stars? Does that sound familiar to you guys? Was that was that something? Because that seems sad to me. No, I would probably cry reading it too, you know? Jesus. Yeah, that would be a heartbreaking story. Oh my god! Firstly, you guys are spoiling the entire story. But secondly, that is a beautiful story. Yeah, talk about silencing spoilers. She doesn't even really need to read it. You guys damn near told her the entire story. I don't even need to read it. Uh huh. Everyone but Kaguya. And they read it. <laughs> of course they did. Even Hayasaka's crying. God damn. God damn it. All right. So we have an after credit. Like, not a scene, like a whole episode. Is this supposed to be like an anime version of that manga? Yes. Okay. Okay. This is like an anime narration of their own story. Like, with their own, like, opening theme song. It's like a shoujo anime. <laughs> this is already a slice of life anime, but they're memeing slice of life animes in slice of life animes. I mean, you guys got the shoujo brain going on right now. Oh. Bro, I can't get over this. Ooh, he's a penguin expert. He's seen Happy Feet a couple of times. With the hand in the hair. 
with the rose petals. This is like some quintessential type shit. You know, this is like some or Mia. What am I hearing? <laughs> what is going on? This looks like it's about to be a hentai. A hentai threesome, I swear to God. Okay, I don't need to go because I'm already at me. For me, this place is so romantic and sensual. I do like the how they I, I do love me an aquarium even though i hate zoos and aquariums at the same time i want those fishes and animals to be out there in the open you know yeah this was the weirdest one fuck no hell yeah all right on to episode eight let's do it the new student council convenes. Last episode was all hilariosity. Now we're getting down to business. The financial auditor. Okay. I was going to say she has a point, but now it's like, you just, you know, I know, right? What? Thank you for standing up for him, Kaguya. Well, first off, you don't even know what was going on. It was a misunderstanding. I can't stand Kaguya. I can't stand her. Exactly what Ishigami was saying, but yes, I guess. Thank you, Chika. <laughs> what the? <laughs> we just need to know Chika has to handle Eno, because apparently Eno only likes Chika. Not the feet on the table. Oh, you're a savage. What is this, Mario Kart? Mm, mm. Oh, he's got a switch. It really is. Marine car. <laughs> he really has got a switch. <laughs> the mustache filter. Gotta love it. Yeah, I'm like, those are not the weirdest faces. Now that's a weird face. Yay, okay. God damn, that was hilarious. That was so funny. <laughs> okay, that was quite the episode. Whoa, what a way to start. Is this really? Ha that was a real situation? Okay, title. Looks like we have to make out. N normally, I would 1 million percent agree with you, but I don't. I actually would not be surprised if she set this all up. Yeah. So she thinks he set it up too. Yeah, okay. So both of them think each other set it up. So this is, they're really locked in. 
and this is not good. <laughs> What an actress. Yeah, right? Both of them have different plans as to what they think the other one wants. So we shall see how this is going to end. <laughs> but... <laughs> And then he goes down to save her, and then he falls as well, and this is how we end up on that situation. God damn, man. I was way too excited. Of course something like that would happen. Is it going to be a gray hair? Okay, so it is just Lint. What is she, faint? What the hell? What is she having, a heart attack? That's, that's like low key scary. Damn. This guy's a real deal Holyfield doctor. Chozo Tanuma. Master cardiologist. I would say that's best case scenario, especially having a family history of heart disease. <laughs> I mean, that's something that, you know. Uh-huh. She's a bit of a contrarian. I can't call it sooner. <laughs> that's funny as fuck. You literally just described what happened. Is she on the verge of like trying to? Yeah, this is probably super embarrassing. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we'll be able to tell. She's gonna see a picture and then her heart's gonna start beating again really fast. Oh, that's... Oh, oh my god. Things have been progressively getting crazier and crazier, you know. It's a flashback of Doctor. <laughs> the same glasses, everything. <laughs> that is hilarious. Yes. Take his advice, run with it. Come on, Kakuya. That's hilarious. Oh, 
てないこれ Nah, Otaka, your daughter is doing fine. What? What was, what was that? That Was that like his ex-wife or his wife? I don't know. I have no idea. What the heck? Well, talk about a couple of funny episodes. Uh, we started off with the episode, the little, <laughs> the little part. Just the whole fact that we keep walking into the council room and seeing like, just, like the most misunderstanding, the most opportunistic timing is crazy. Um, we walked in, we saw Ishigami changing, then we had this whole discussion about boxer briefs versus boxers versus briefs and how boxer briefs make you a man whore. And then the misunderstanding between Kaguya and Miyuki asking what kind of underwear does he wear or what kind of underwear does he like, indicating that he thinks she's asking for her to wear for him. It's, it's just, it's just so funny. Like, I, I don't even know what to think. And then the whole playing the game with the pictures of breaking the rules then playing the Mario Kart like this this these are so slice of life just anthological stories but they're so hilarious and there is some sort of overarching group because we're, we're getting progressively further like I'm saying further and further into into the relationship and I do think after a few, what, what do you want to say like five to seven more misunderstandings like this I think maybe something might happen you never know could you guys answer me one thing if you don't mind you guys who have read the light novels or the manga know is season three supposed to be the end or are is there like enough for a seasons four five and six or like what are we thinking about that just so i have some sort of clue but i love when um what did the nurse say something like something along the lines of yes it's they call it being a sundari <laughs> like it's so funny i just this show is so meta breaking for it's so funny i love it but hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did please leave a like let me know your thoughts down below don't forget to subscribe and to click that bell so you guys always know when i post over here on the dapper channel make sure you guys check out the social medias instagram tiktok twitter all at dapper darius and if you guys want early access full length four episodes one week check out that patreon links are down below like always i appreciate y'all have a great day don't forget to drink some water tell someone you love them peace out dapper what